Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Opus Magnum. We left off last episode. Uh, we tried three times to do our best on refined gold. I mean, I passed it on the first time, and then uh, I did the best on the second time. The third time was uh, not as great. So we're going to move on to face powder. Have you seen Lady Von Teschen re recently? A few days ago. Why? Do you notice how pale her face is? Oh, she's known for her pallor. Why? Did someone ask you to do something about it? Our man himself did. And I think these voices are slowly changing over the over the episodes, but we're going to try to stick to something. It's gotten worse lately. People are whispering about her health. But that's unfortunate. The lady hasn't had an easy time of things. I'd hate for her to be slandered on top of it all. All right. So we're making powder for the milady's face. So... We've got salt and earth. Oh, we only got one to pick from, so we need to... This is going to be like a rotary thing, I want to say. Hang on a sec, I'm trying to get situated in my chair here. Okay. Uh, let's see here. So, obviously, the first thing we're going to want to do is... Grab one of these and transmute it into salt. And then we're going to need to bind it together and transmute it into salt. By passing, oh, passing over it transmutes it into salt. So that would mean we need a bounder there. Like that. So grab it. So let's let's start out. We're gonna grab, rotate left twice, and drop. Or right twice and drop. Then we are going to rotate left twice. Grab. One, two, three. Rotate right three times. One, two, three. And that should, and then drop. And that should create what I need. Oh, and then I need a, I need this. Uh, actually, let's replace replace this with a piston. We're gonna keep that in there. Just drag it all down like I did before. Shit. So I'm I'm bummed out that you can't copy and paste. Because that would make things a good deal easier for me. And then we're going to get rid of one. Swap this around. Start there. Because <laughs> then what we can do is... We drop this... Drop this off there. I mean, do we need to drop it? What happens if we just bring it over? Oh, shit. Drop. Rotate left. Grab. Oh, you know what? Needs, this, these are wrong. It needs to be left three. So, A, A, A. Yeah, it doesn't need to be dropped. It just needs to be brought over. So, extend, and then just extend out one. Then drop. So, extend out. Drop. And then reset. That should do it. I think this is gonna. Oh, you know what? Um, stop, because we we forgot to delete this. We uh, that should. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. Sorry, hit the table there. I think I might be a little heavy on the cycles, but the 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 area and the cost, I think I'm gonna be good. I think I could cut down on the area actually. So cost real pretty good. Cycles was a little heavy, and area was pretty good. What if we, because we're using this area, and this is extra, so what if we did this? So this is going to create it there. And then if we, you know what, if we cycle this around like that, then all we need to do, then I don't need to use, I don't need a piston if I do it like this. Let's go back to a normal arm.
Well, this part we don't need. Get rid of this. So grab, rotate, and then it's one, two, three, four to get back, two to get back that way. So grab, rotate, turn into salt, drop, rotate back, grab. Then it needs to go. So we're here. We've got to go one, two, three to the left. And then we're holding on to this and then all I would need to do because it'd be salt up there actually if we go the other way around can I rotate I'm wondering if I if I can rotate one through my my own arm I'm not sure I would assume no but we'll see because then I would need to just pivot left once and to be there nope okay so we can't do it like that So I think I don't think this is gonna save us any. I don't think this is gonna be better, but we could still try it because what we need to do is rotate it to the right, and that's gonna swing it through this area here. So instead of pivoting left once, we need to pivot right. Let's see. Do we need to pivot at all? No, we don't. So, stop this. So, now we need a reset, and that should be do it. That should do it. Nope. So, what, what, what do we got wrong here? Uh, let's go stage by stage. Grab. Pivot. Pivot. Drop. Pivot pivot, grab, pivot, 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 and then left twice. What? No, right twice. Sorry, right twice. Nope. What am I messing up here? Grab that, move it around. So that's fine. Wait, no, 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 that's not what I wanted you to do. I wanted you to go one step at a time so I could watch it. So that it bonds there. And then it goes the wrong direction. Right? Why does it go the wrong way? Do I have one too many of those on? There we go. I had one too many on. My bad. Alright, that's gonna cut down. So, Airy, I don't think I could make it any smaller than that. But then again, I was I had that situation the last time too. All right, so I nail on the head with the area. Um not great uh, area in cost, but cycles not too great. Okay. I think I I, I can accept that one. See, I think the only way to make it I'm trying to think of a way to make it less cycles because there is some backpedaling on this, so... That's the only thing about it, is there's a bunch of backpedaling. But there's only one input, so I have to backpedal a little. There's not two inputs. I don't have two inputs to use, so there's no way for me to not backpedal on it. Thinking, what if we, uh, huh? 
Huh, let's see, so... Uh, I think we just rotate it a little bit. Wait, isn't that how I had it before, though? That's how I had it before. Grab. So how can we make this fewer cycles? Grab, drop. You know what? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bust my butt trying to make sure that this one is absolutely perfect. We got this one. We did pretty good on it without too much trouble. Uh, so we're just gonna call it here. Thanks for watching everybody, and we'll see you next time.